Where does Daddy have to go check in? <laughs> Do it, son. We're gonna try this one. Here we go. Boom! That's what you call a bullseye, big boy. Yeah. Look at that. That's a bullseye. Where's the bullseye? Now you do it. <laughs> you got stuck. What's crazy is Bass just got accused of being Paula Finley. So, hey, Paula Finley, if you're out there, you have a look alike. Compliment for me, maybe not. Yeah, so some guy come running out of the crowd. Paula, Paula! transition it's been a rush this morning but it's gonna be all right we're gonna get in the water all right. try to get a little warm up yes we'll What's get this party pressure? started all right welcome to xterra 2024. each station on the bike when it comes out on p and balls road you need to pull over and refill whatever container you have with you at their system Thank you. 
All right, that's swim. Whew. Slower than I thought. Be all right. Let's get this mountain bike going. The course is different this year. Uh oh. Uh. I'm still swimming, man. All right, I just want to say thanks for watching and you know, talk through the bike, of course, just a little bit. So the bike course was actually more than I thought it was going to be. This was much more difficult than last year's. Last year, you started off at about a mile and a half of road. About half of that mile, or excuse me, about half of the mile and a half was uphill. But you had about a mile before you got to that half a mile, basically recover from the swim. Um, last year, I got into this, went about two miles, got a, got a flat, took me about 30 minutes to find it, and it just made, it may actually made it kind of fun for me, being in, in the back, passing people and being involved. Well, this time, I was in the front, and this was tough. I mean, climbing from the beginning, you're climbing, 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 there's some sections that are fast, you see here in the video, but I'm talking a lot of climbing. There was so much elevation change in this climbing that there were, I wouldn't say many may be the wrong word, but I did see guys that were actually having to stop and walk like you see right here to push up some of the, these these climbs. And that's that's brutal on you. If you're doing that, you're, you're in survival mode. You're not in racing mode. <laughs> I didn't have to do that, thankfully, but I want you to know I thought about it. Anyway, so we went through the bike ride and um, it, it was just, I would say what's crazy is early in the bike ride, about two miles in, my calf started cramping up a little bit. That's my fault, totally my fault. Nutrition, it was, was an issue. I didn't, I didn't hydrate properly. I didn't have any type of gels or anything like that. And maybe I didn't have the right nutrition the night before. And I just wasn't prepared properly. Um, I could have done a little bit better preparation in the weeks up to the race, but just getting your nutrition right is so important in these kind of races because it did get hot really quick. Uh, and, and, and I wouldn't say it's hot, but the humidity in this area is nice. it's going to sap uh -oh. it out of you. I, I started, because I cramped a little bit, I basically went into a mode where I wasn't going to push it at all and just do my best to try get through it without falling, falling apart and cramping up totally. Anyways, thanks for watching. I'll let y'all see the rest of the video. Like the stuff. Like, subscribe, and all that stuff. Or buy a t-shirt. Thanks for watching. Enjoy. Sure that we take care of it before you're on the ladder.
All right, 2024 Xterra is done. Had a good time. Thanks for watching. We'll see y'all on the next adventure. Call the end waffles. The best. Look at that. The best. Ooh. This is really good. Perfect. Yeah.